Uh, I think for the central bank, you know, RBI is one of the few central banks which has still remained very cautious uh, on its outlook. Uh, I think it's been um, it's been on hold for quite some time now since February of last year. Uh, but even then, talking about domestic inflation needing to be closer to the target, which has not been met as yet, uh, and they're very optimistic on growth. Uh, so now, given this mix uh, and the emphasis on keeping liquidity uh, on a tight leash onshore, uh, I think it. it kind of uh, aligns with our view that we, we don't expect any change in neither in the stance nor their uh, you know uh, policy rate per se uh, and talking about the way ahead um, i would think you know our we are leaning towards the late end of the year uh, in fact for a rate cut so you know uh, probably closer to october to, uh, fourth, fourth quarter of 2024 before that you could see some signs of either uh, you know um, go easier on the liquidity front uh, which, which just allow liquidity to be at the neutral or a slight surplus uh, and then perhaps a change in stance which is right now quite hawkish and change that to a neutral setting I think that could precede the actual cut uh, but we don't expect any easing uh, you know at least for the next uh, couple of quarters is it fair to say that even a q4 rate cut is not necessarily guaranteed given uh, the risks on the agriculture side we were talking earlier of a heat wave in india and the fact that the economy is is growing faster than expected is is india and the policy outlook almost a victim of its own success when you look at what's happening in the economy to a certain extent um, so, you know, if I were to talk about the growth outlook first, uh, growth has been very strong. It's perhaps closer to about 8% in the year just ended, and we're going to be closer to about 7%, 7.2% in the year that we're going by. This is at least by central bank's own assessment. Um, so you have strong growth. Uh, again, you know, there's no need to stimulate uh, the economy. And the other, other hand, absolutely, inflation is something that they've been concerned about. They've been talk taking a cautious view on it. Uh, and in two, three months, we're going to enter the very crucial southwest monsoon, um, you know, for food grain production, uh, and so forth. So a heat wave will precede that and then you might uh, hopefully weather conditions will turn by then. Uh, so given all these factors and then of course the, we haven't spoken about the global piece which is that we really don't uh, have a good visibility on when and how much the US central bank would uh, move mm. by. So given these pieces um, I think the central bank, the RBI would tend to be uh, much more uh, you know, cautious on the way forward rather than cut preemptively. Yeah.